Brian again from GumballTech.com and today I have Quick Widgets. It's a nice lock screen mod for an iPhone or iPod Touch that adds widgets to your home screen. It is currently free as it is in beta. The developers plan on keeping it free as well. The only thing they plan on charging is this widget right here, the call to one, where you can double tap on it and then you can make a call to anybody. From your lock screen and to add widgets and move them around is as simple as holding on one until oops holding on one until it uh, wiggles like this and you can move them around wherever you want you could move them to a different page you could get rid of it altogether and then on the bottom you have your available widgets right now there are 11 of them I'll put the calendar back up and it just pops up right there once you tap on it you could add it as many times as you want and some widgets have options that you could change like the weather widget you could change your location and auto refresh um, there are some little extra ones like the camera and the flashlight where if you double tap on the flashlight your brightness will go all the way up and your screen will turn right. Double tap on it and it goes back to your lock screen. The camera one, if you double tap on it, it opens up the camera so you can take quick photos without even having to unlock your phone. And this green one right here is usually where my emails would show up, but I don't have any right now, so they're not there. You also get your Google search one and a notes widget where you can add anything you want. There is also one called Quick Reply for SMS where you could reply to anybody's text messages right from your lock screen. You get your weather, your quick dial. You also get your clock that you would see if you were at your clock app. I'm going to get rid of that one because I don't like it. And you get another clock like this, which also displays the seconds. In the settings application, you could add two of these clocks right here. So you could have one for your, your time zone and one for somewhere else. And if we go to the settings application, the settings app does not work with Pogo Plank, so you have to turn it off before you uh, try and go to the settings app. So, I'm going to respring real quick. Now, when you first turn on your phone, it takes about three to four seconds for your widgets to come back up on your lock screen. So, if they don't come up, don't worry. They'll come up eventually. Everything's all ugly and stuff. So, here it is right here, the silver one. You just tap on that, and it instantly opens up. You then go to the settings button, then you go to quick lock screen, and from there you can change all your usual things, like show alternative clocks, that will bring up two of the normal looking lock, uh, clocks on your lock screen. Um, if you want to have the clocks shown on all screens, you could do so here. You could disable everything altogether. You could also change the color scheme of some of the widgets see a nice preview of them all right here and that about does it for this it's really easy to use it's free and it's nice compared to smart screen a telescreen sigits uh, this definitely beats all of them and that wraps up this video, so go to gumballtech.com to see what else we got. We have more videos coming soon. Thanks for watching.